Ah, the sweet, sweet smell of general pain sore hands. What the hell have we done with this playthrough? Somebody said, uh, resurrect general pain, and then you can have general pain sore hands marry his original, his original form. So, um, that's, that's pretty much the plan going forward. Yep. Oh, that's strange. I don't remember actually filling up the rest of these, uh, the rest of these biovats. I wonder what's going on with that one. Well, anyway, let's get King Stench's spare body, sorry, Boone's spare body out of the, uh, out of the incubator there. Now, you may remember during yesterday's episode, we have plateaued. We have hit the end of the research train entirely because we are just too big brain here. But have you ever been so big brain that you're able to- Oh. Uh. Shit. Um. <laughs> like I was saying, have you ever been so big brain that you've broken through the very tech prints themselves? <laughs> and then forgot to enable the mod that lets you do that. <laughs> I just think that tech prints without traders is gonna make this feel like a half-finished campaign, especially when we've unlocked basically everything else. Now, today we're heading out there to go and kill ourselves a few mechanoids. One or two or many. Just like a whole bunch. We should focus on trying to destroy the mechanoid agents and maybe the anti-mech agents first would be a good choice because that's our that's a kind of secret anti-mechanoid weapon and it's working pretty damn well but they do also have a very literal silver bullet against that right and that's probably where we'll head over to first but we can't really fight them using mechs for for i mean fairly obvious reasons huh I feel, I feel like trying to fight the anti-mech squad with mechs is a <laughs> it's a poor idea the general always had that rules to never use bionics to never sacrifice our humanity but if we're doing it to the general who I think is a little bit far gone at this point, given that he's inhabiting his dead wife's flesh suit. <laughs> I feel like your bionic arm probably isn't much by comparison. That's fairly tame compared to what he did yesterday. Ooh. Nuclear launcher in the freezer. Oh, good news. <laughs> Whoops, I seem to have misplaced my nuclear missile. <laughs> I love with the weapon chief mod, she's just sat there with the, with the nuclear thing strapped to her back. Just minding her own business, doing a regular desk job. Grip weapon is too dangerous for shooting. <laughs> that would have been amazing, though. You go to use the training dummies and rock up with your with your missile launcher. I feel like I should put that in a cupboard. It just doesn't seem safe. Ah, uh, no, I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna unequip that. Put that safely away. We haven't got anywhere to safely put it away. There you go. Locked away safely in the vault, along with our other horrifying weapons. What can we do with these? Could we infect the mage, the magents? <laughs> After a great start today. Could we infect the mechanoid agents with the mechanoid plague and turn them into mechanoids? Teach them a, uh, a lesson in irony. Hold on. If we use skill hack to repeatedly bump all of General Painsaw Hands' skills up to, say, 20 across the board, then if we duplicate that stack using the duplicate stack button, and then if we were to, say, install it into a whole new host of bodies, we could have 20 skill colonists. Oh, this is, oh, this is actually genius. Okay, right, first thing we need, then, is that skill trainer. We, we, we need the skill trainer assembly terminal just because I don't think King Snitch would be able to do that by themselves. This is going to be actually a perfect colony. A completely perfect colony. We just won't tell Kirillin and King Snitch and Boone and Dark White and Naughty and the Anushan class. They might object to having their brains overwritten by the very perfect General Painsaw hands, but they don't need to know. Shh. That'll be our secret. Shh. <laughs> oh, why is it so expensive? My god. I'm trying to expand the grid and get everything connected up to our you know, like Glitter World Matrix, given that that was the, the big inspiration behind this. <laughs> it's so expensive. <laughs> Thank God for these advanced deep drills. Otherwise, this th we, we never would have been able to build any of this stuff. Oh, no. And that could be an oh-no for either one of these things. Hello, Manhunter Pack. It's Derek Lodge and his good friends. Hello. Good God, that's a lot of mega slots. Now, this is maybe a bigger hole. no <laughs> Oh, no. What? No, no, no. <laughs> Boone courted chainsaw hands. Oh, sorry, general painsaw hands by making fun of her weight. Well, I mean, if if that works, it's a oh, it's a bold strategy, Boone. Only if you were slightly more perfect. Maybe she'd really love you then, Boone. Oh my God. Ah. Uh, well, let's put the romance aside for a second. <laughs> Given that everybody might be about to die. Shit. Oh shit. Well, it's just like the end of the Matrix Three. Forgettable and nonsensical. <laughs> oh no! Oh shit! <laughs> um. Right. Yeah. No. Get in. Get in the mech frames. 
Get in the get, get in the mech frame. General Payne saw hands. Come and get in the mech frame. Oh no. This is a disaster. How have these guys been the raid to get the closest to killing us? What was that? <gasps> They're destroying the mechs better than the people with the anti-mech suit guns are destroying the mechs. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> wow. That's actually amazing. What a war. What a battle. That was better than any mechanoid. Look at how much damage they did. Jesus Christ. Didn't even get that much meat for the meat grinder either because it was all bloody scarier. In fact, we, I think we had one. Right, one, two. Oh, well, that sucks. One, two, three. Three sloths and all of that. Product is finished. Pro Wait, we're still making... We're still separating uranium. Oh, well, shit. In that case, I mean, um... I mean, we, I was going to say do forever. Yeah, no, we might as... We, we very much might as well. There you go. Forever nuclear warheads. That seems like a good idea. <laughs> this may be one of the most messed up things I'm ever going to do in this game. And that really does say a lot. Helamex serums. Oh, good. That would be uh, very convenient if, say, for example, someone was missing a head. What do you mean marriage is on? No. Boon told... No! When Boon's not ready yet. He's not perfect. Well, I suppose at the very minimum, we can make General Painsaw hands a bit more perfect. There you go. Some more <laughs> melee skill for you. I want people to get suspicious after all. But like, wow, uh, Chainsaw Hand suddenly has a little less medical, a little, a little less melee skill. I suppose it could be medical skill, depending on what you're doing with those Chainsaw Hands. They'd probably be more suspicious about the fact that she doesn't have Chainsaw Hands anymore. <laughs> Perfection is a difficult job, but somebody has to step up. Somebody has to do it. Can't believe that all, the, all that's standing between us and Project Perfection right now is goddamn herbal medicine. Throw herbal medicine, and then with that, we can make neutramine, if I remember correctly. Uh, neutramine requires herbal medicine and psychoid leaves. With that, we can make the glutter world medicine. With that, we can make a healer mech serum. And then with that, you're in for a cursed wedding. Let me tell you. No! Nobody will stand in the way of perfection. Oh, shit. Well, there's a lot of people. <laughs> Oh no, look at how many demolishers there are. Somebody needs to go and volunteer waking that mech cluster up. No, I'm not taking any damn risks with General... Oh my lord. <laughs> I thought that was like the ocular jungle from Alpha Biomes then. It's just a pile of rotten mega sloths. Wow. Hello? Oh, well, they've thought of everything, haven't they? You sneaky little mechanoids. Do they have a high shield or is it just a low shield? Because, uh, low shield, low shield. Oh, it's a bad day to be a mechanoid. <laughs> oh, do forever. Do forever. Yes. Yes. God, I hope they don't have a high shield now. Yes. <laughs> this is, it just never gets old. It just never, ever, ever, ever gets old. Oh god, we've we've knocked out the entire base, but it's so it's always worth it. You gotta make a few sacrifices for a nice little firework show. Oh, the shield generator's down. You know, I think we'll be alright, funnily enough. Oh, I for one just can't believe he nerfed the mechs. No, I just can't believe he's done it. He's always gotta make the game too difficult. Always too difficult. Ah. Now back to the important things. Duplicate stack in the quantum matrix. There we go, in a cloud of red mist. Just ignore that. You don't, you don't need to worry about that. There we go. Successfully duplicated cortical stack. Oh. Original copy. I mean, no, that's definitely a copy. Unless a copy of a copy becomes an original. I presume so. And then we could just say, keep doing that. Oh, you cloned it again? <laughs> oh. We've got three general paints now, huh? I mean, I'm... I'm not complaining. I think let's try and keep a good 10 cortical stacks. Perfection requires a bit of sacrifice, and that's going to be a lot of resources. But you've just got to think big. You've got to think big in these things. This is good. This is so good. Sorry, but the general has given her orders. Maybe there was something in those cortical sleeves. Maybe a little mind control. Sometimes you've just got to be prepared to put humanity first. By any means necessary. You've got to make sure that that humanity that you're putting first is the best kind of humanity. The best kind of humanity. Hi. My, how lovely humanity looks. It's what Chainsaw Hands would have wanted. 
This is what Chainsaw Hands would have wanted, okay? <laughs> Just miss her. Oh! You cannot stop blessed perfection! So sorry, what is this? What the hell is this? They saved their defensive positions. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Boy, I hope those turrets are fast. Get in the get in the mech. Chainsaw hands and chainsaw hands. And chainsaw hands. Uh, general pain saw hands. No, you don't get to pilot a mech until you've sorted your hair out. It's disrespectful. The oppression of the, the what's it called? The styling station will not stand. <laughs> you fools! You are already too late. Well, this is off to a pretty damn good start. We need a few more sleeves to grow before we can bring back the whole squad. If you're wondering, no, no, they're really not happy about it. They've got a lot, of, a lot of negatives going on here. But unfortunately for them, the decryption bench has the ability to convert us to ideology. So all of those previous people, like King Snitch, when King Snitch went berserk, and the Unwise, who was always that different ideology, they are now converted. They're on board whether they like it or not. A little bit of technical wizardry from old General Painsaw Hands. But unfortunately, we do need to do one more thing. If I'm not mistaken, these are what, like 15? 15, 15 crafting, 15 intellectual. And I think the only person who's even remotely close to that would be your guy, General Painsaw Hands. The only person who can keep committing these horrible, horrible, sinful crimes. Oh! Of course, we haven't got any silence anymore. Well, I mean, for now, Neuro... Neuroformer. Neuroformer. Oh. <laughs> everybody gets a skill hack. And everybody raises everybody. And they've still got their humanity. It's still Boone. Boone is just in a different shell. And it's still Yanosh and King Snitch and Dark White and Corellis. So still all your favorites. They're still the same people under there. They've just been mind controlled and horribly and ethically experimented on. That's fine. Humanity first. Everyone said bring back chainsaw hands. Is this not what you wanted? I saw people in Discord signing a petition. Bring back Chainsaw Hands. Well, she's back. There she is. And there she is. <laughs> and there she is. And there. And there. And there. Oh, and then there's another six. Just ready. Just, just ready to pop out any time now. We are all Chainsaw Hands on this auspicious occasion. And boop. And two. And three. There you go. And then we say Anomaly. And then we just carry on. And you know what Chainsaw Hands would have really loved? Uh, no recreation. Only meditation. Come on, everybody. Gather round. There's enough for every Chainsaw Hands. We need a little intellectual for General Painsaw Hands. Thank you very... 13? What? <laughs> just go from 13 to 13? Why? Right, okay, skill hack. And then, skill hack. Intellectual on yourself. Oh! It doesn't work? Why? I don't think we're ever going to be able to make the Resurrector Max Serum. What about skill trainers? Maybe skill trainers will work. Oh, uh, okay. Well, forget about making one of each. Let's just go purely for intellectual then. Ooh. Okay, that time it worked. Why was it being weird before? <laughs> That's a lot of fun. I like that a lot. Ah, here we go. Right, come here, General. Oh, come here, General Chainsaw Hands. 15 intellectual. Come on. 15? 14.84? Okay. This should be it, I hope. Please just let me make a let me make a little serum. Let me make a little serum for my guy. And boom. Level 15 intellectual. Okay, so now in theory we can say not assigned to drugs. Alright, what hello? <laughs> what a nice dog. Prioritize producing drugs. Making medicine. Making medicine? No, no, no. I need you to make he healer mech serums. Not enough neutramine. Oh, classic. What are we lacking? Herbal medicine. Oh, for God's sake. Just grow the herbal medicine. Yep. Yeah, all right. Why are the man hunting packs turning up now? <laughs> Did I accidentally use it on Boone? Wait, Boone is in the mech. Shit, I think I might have accidentally used that intellectual blast on Boone. Or was it a shooting skill? Well, either way, we've got all four mechs manned by... <laughs> Chainsaw hands. <laughs> Boy, who do you think is going to win this one? Oh, this is going to be a real close fight. Ah. Yeah, like, don't blow each other up, though. Otherwise, it might be a close fight. I'm not even sure I know what happened. There we go. But, of course, the Resurrector Mech needs 17 intellectual. No pressure. 16.81. Ooh, you're telling me there's a chance. Who is almost off of cooldown? Anyone? Uh, Corellin's kind of close. Oh, God, they're all about the same level. 
Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's the mor- I- No. 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 Chainsaw hands back, they said. <laughs> <laughs> it's just 17 skill. That's it. That's all we need. Uh, somebody get down here. Janosch, thank you. Thank you. Legendary chainsaw hands looking Janosch. Go. Bazinga. Oh my god, we've actually done it. Oh, how long's that gonna take? 5,000 work. Ooh, finish growing sleeves, you say? Thank you. What a, what a kind gift. Not all of them. Why is that one not done, but the rest are? How strange. Ah, there you go. Now we can bring back the rest of the colony who are all inside the Matrix, I think. Hello. There you go, Moira. Welcome back. Salmel, welcome back. The best part about being chainsaw hands is there is just so many chainsaw hands. Naughty Classen, who was Naughty Pickers. Did you get remarried? Oh, you did get remarried. <laughs> When did that happen? No sleeve. Oh, we can deal with that. Hang on a second. Oh, this is... This is just horrible. <laughs> there you go. Everybody's back and they're better than ever. Let's make sure we're giving them the silence as well so we're not missing out on all that fantastic chainsaw hands potential. Oh, you've already got level 9. You're, you're a little bit too late. This is so many levels of cursed. I don't even know who's who anymore. Oh, maybe that's for the best. Welcome back, big fella. Welcome back. <laughs> General Payne just resurrected himself using skills transferred to him via other copies of his wife puppeted by everyone he's ever known. Ex-wife. She was his ex-wife. She had brain damage and then she was cured from the brain damage and then divorced him. So, I mean, that really does say a lot about society. <laughs> it's just a very flexible interpretation of till death do we part. In fact, in death, they became closer than ever before. Closer than ever. I think the truth is we can't keep him here. We said we weren't going to sacrifice our humanity. And look, they're, they're all human. They're all human up there in their brain. Externally, they might be slightly different to human, but they're all still human. With the exception of General Payne, who's been the same since the very beginning. I really think there's only one thing we can do with General Payne at this stage. And I think one computer core will have to try and find a persona core somewhere for the poor guy. Very normal, very normal way to get someone off of a, off of a room world. Just have a dozen copies of his ex-wife building him a, a ship to safety. Just, I just love how down-to-earth and normal this series has been. Just a very simple proposition. Man versus machine. Nothing weird at all. Now we need a Persona core. Um. <laughs> that could be a slight problem. You got any, I got any of those Persona cores? Huh? <laughs> This is going to be a confusing afternoon for you. <gasps> King Snitch hands! Run! Okay, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. We haven't got time to wait for the whole squad to turn up. Uh, let's just get out who we can. A little more dangerous than I'd like. Oh, Corellin, get in the mech. Get in the mech. Come on, you shits. Get a little closer. Stop hiding behind that damn wall. There's ten chainsaw hands with your name on it back here. Well, I mean, they've all got different names. It's about the only part that is different these days. Oh! Okay. Well, that was unexpected. They're just going for a straight up charge now. Ah, oh, shit. Good luck, squad. No. Oh. oh, God, the shield. Take a step back. Take a step back. What a goddamn mess, huh? <laughs> this is so much. <laughs> this is so good. <laughs> Thank you, Chainsaw Hands. Great job. Take the day off. Ward Partners. Hello. General Payne. Well, uh, General Payne saw. Well, uh, whoever. Whoever has seniority at this point. My brother in Christ, I will take that off of your hands. See you later, General Payne. Thanks for joining us, but the rest of this journey needs 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 a special touch. If anybody deserves a second chance, it's our guy, General Payne. 15 days, the reactor's gonna warm up, and in that time, we're gonna have to fight off all sorts of very horrible, very stinky mechanoids. Nort Power would be really nice to get to make this whole thing a little smoother. Getting everybody psychic flight so they can go around the planet as easily as they like. With transport pods, no caravans. We put them in the mechs and we blast them off. In fact, we might be able to get it for almost all of them. Oh, shit. Uh, well, the ones that we actually have, you know, the powers a lot for, that is. Okay, there we go. That's enough for... What? Wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why didn't that give us two silent levels? I don't understand. I think I'm losing my mind a little bit. There you go. No, 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 no. No, you can't, you can't defeat General Payne. You can't defeat General Payne. Oh, that's a lot of people. Um, you know what, Chainsaw Hands? Go deal with that one. Ooh, 
Okay, well, uh, tweak the leg. Shit. Oh, <laughs> Wow, that sucks. That's, uh, that really sucks. Let's go for uh, near invulnerability. Yeah, how about now? Sweep the leg. Sweep the leg. Do it for general pain. Kill it. No! Oh! You shit. She disarmed it. Oh, well, that's pretty damn good. All right, you can kill it in your own time now. That's just your punching bag. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's a lot of big, strong mechanoids. <laughs> Holy shit. These are the big, new, nice, shiny mechanoids, aren't they? Shit. All right, well, let's go forward a little bit. Try and stop them knocking down the walls where we can avoid it. Oh, man. The firepower we've got is just so good. We need to shore up this wall. Because they, they're going to break through and immediately go for the ship reactor. Um, let's just throw down like a whole other layer of steel. I know it's not much, but it's a pretty cheap way to slow them down a bit more. Oh, she's going out there. Oh, you brave fool. Can we also cast these? Oh, my God. Okay, okay. I like that. I like that a lot. Just just be careful. Let's go near invulnerability. There you go. And then just like hop in there. Can't jump over the wall. That would be ridiculous. Uh, kill it dead. Sweep the legs. Sweep the legs. Sweep the legs. There you go. Perfect. Just swept the legs. Sir, this is private property. We're going to have to ask you to leave. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, I was just about to get everybody out of the mechs, but I'm glad I didn't now. This could be non-stop mech on mech action. Well, it's better than chainsaw hands on chainsaw hands action. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, there you go. Hold squads together. Uh, we could set them all to also cast these. If I do that, do you think it'll do it for everyone? Because that'd be really helpful. Uh, how are we looking? Did it work? It didn't. Okay, I'll go through them all independently and just set them to auto cast their powers. Uh, people have said that this is kind of a mixed bag. Sometimes it's really good, sometimes it's not so much. Honestly, them casting it at all is better than relying on me to do it all individually. Okay, better question is then what the hell are we up against? <laughs> oh my god! That's a lot of centipedes. Look, like the sweep the leg tactic isn't working as well as it used to. Let's see if we can push forward and maybe get a few shots off. Oh, do you think we can maybe thread a shot? Hmm. I think maybe like the Arctic Gale or something might be able to actually get through the shield. Let's go forward. I, I'm going to assume direct control because you're probably... No, 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 that's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. Uh, give me give me that one. It's got a range to it, but it's, oh, it's dangerous. Hey, stop firing a second. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, ho hold on. Hold, hold, hold. Go. Nice. Is that going to do enough damage to kill it? Not even remotely. Well, it was worth a go. Oh, Krillin, 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 Krillin. Thank you, little friendly mechs. Oh, God. We've baited them out of the shield, though. This was this was accidentally big brain. All we had to do was get Krillin shot. I think the big problem... Fucking hell. I think the big problem with the all-out mech war is the mech... We, we need to actually get out of the mechs to repair the armor. Press forward a little bit. Get a few more shots and see if we can get them out of the shield a bit more. Come on. Come on, that's it. Come and fight the mechs. <laughs> yeah, this is what I had in mind. This is what I had in mind. Do you think eventually the shield could burst? No, I don't think it will. I think we're actually going to have to wait for them to slightly come out of the shield like that and hope that our people get a good shot in. Okay, General Painsaw Hands, this one is on you, my friend. Let's go charge to assault on you. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, she just goes for it. Boom. Bring it down. Sweep the legs. Sweep the legs. Oh, click countered shit. This is a dangerous place to be. I don't like this at all. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh, they're just un uh, they're unstoppable like this. We're going to have to go inside the shield. Keep pushing. <laughs> oh, King Stitch. Shit. Okay, okay. We need to give them a break now. Uh, get out of your mechs. Don't. But don't just park it there, you weirdo. Okay, I, I think we'll just go repair armor bloody fast. Oh, man, that one was almost destroyed. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> that could have been close. Good as new. Oh, great. Just in time for another raid. <laughs> oh, King Snitch. Oh, you moron. Where are they going? Are they going up through the bloody mountain? No, don't do that. Oh, don't do that. Come on, that's it. You get away from that wall. It's like having a naughty dog. Uh, you guys can like, you guys can like do stuff though. That's, that's, that's all good. That's fine. You get to work. I love that they can get in, set the shields up, really soften them up. And then the, the real kind of heavy guns can, no, can come in afterwards. Not you. Let's tidy this one up fast so they can actually have a day off. That'd be quite nice. There you go. Boom. Done. Oh, <laughs> easy. Us never ends. <laughs> oh no. Not the living room. Oh shit. 
Oh, God. Ash, get out of there. Oh. Oh, watch out for Ivy. I mean, she can't die. She's like biological immortal. Turn around and sweep the legs. Do something. You can't do anything. Oh, brilliant. I must feel like I should just leave them in the mech frames at this stage, huh? Oh, this is going to be a messy affair. Ash, uh, someone needs to save Ash. Or pick up Ash. Go. Why the living room? Unbelievable rudeness. Uh, sweep the leg, Corellan. You have learned from the best. Kill it. What? Oh, Van Scyther. Oh, shit. Yeah, no, you're right. That would be the case. Advanced Lancers, too. Advanced Knights. Oh, shit. Oh, the new trimming. You shit. I think... Uh, did we even have any? Maybe we didn't have any because it wasn't refueled. Okay, that's not too bad. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, Ash is going to die. Okay, so you two can come in here. Uh, you can patch Ash up bloody fast. 0 0.4 hours. I don't think we're going to make it in time. Shit. I could have... Uh, to be fair, I could have moved him mid-combat. Mid, mid but, you know, a little, little distracted. Uh, here's an idea. Watch this. Ready? You die. You die. Uh, right now. Or up and die. There you go. And then, uh, one of... One of those. And it's like nothing ever happened. Okay, what's this one? Oh my god, what is that? Hang on, it's a siege. A quote-unquote siege. Yeah, we'll see about that. Yeah, how about you siege this? Fucking mechanoids. Get out of here. <laughs> ah. Uh, deals with that. We do pay the price now of not being able to charge by mech, so that could have been a could have been a, uh, an ill-advised idea. But is it, is it even worth saving General Payne at this point? Fuck it. Or just say the ship blow up. Uh, General Payne died on the way back to his own planet. <laughs> we don't need to draft everybody. We got more nukes. We got like twelve more. Oh god, the tension's killing me. I mean, not as much as it's gonna kill them. <laughs> wow! Imagine being completely unscathed from two nuclear blasts. What a play. Actually just walked away. Actually just- that's future main character right there. No, I think I'm gonna preemptively load these again. Are oh, we gonna get them ready to fire again, I think? Oh my god, we finally got a cortical stack. It's working. <laughs> I knew I hadn't done something wrong. What have we got here? Kane. Oh, Kane. We can stall it in a body of someone we capture, and then we can kill them again. Alternatively, we wipe it out, and then poor old Kane becomes another copy of, um, you know, good old-fashioned, uh, General Chainsaw hands. 7.5 days. We are halfway through sending General Payne to space. Tomorrow, we're gonna wrap that up in about two seconds flat, because... I don't know how many more mechanoids I can fight. <laughs> and then who knows what will happen. Maybe we'll find a way to defeat the mechanoids. Maybe we'll find a secret weapon. Maybe we'll find some other way to, to finally stop them once and for all. Or maybe we won't even stop them in the first place. In the last place. Because that's the final thing we're going to do. Thank you for joining me. I apologize about this episode being late. I was very unwell. Thank you, though, for bearing with me. The series will end tomorrow. I, th I, think, that, I think that will be all we can do. That will be the, the, the war will be over one way or another. Thank you to that Cato, somebody, Castle, Emily, Galupo, Daffid NZ, 501, Ethan Vasilevsky, Christina, Arab, Sir Kelly, 21, Ian McComb, Scott Laketon, Speedy, Elma Delma, Flying Spaghetti Monster, Dan Cool W, Irish Badger, Snow Lauger, Juicy Pickle, Vash, Sajuk1986, Guardian Easter, Philoys, O Trash Panda, Caius, Holiday C, Erin, Commissar, JK, and Q. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for bearing with me. And tomorrow, tomorrow it will end. At <laughs> long last. If I see chainsaw hands again, I think I will go insane. Thank you to Yannick, Gavin, Mr. Hanky, Selena Krieg, Beth, uh, aka Chutney, Parsa Sol, Johnny, Tol Tedith. The Gentleman, Ghostronaut, Nikki in Wonderland, Strange Inc., The Unwise, Padre 146, Lopta, Manny, Kashada, Rave Pirate, Tiberian Fest, Wojtek Feltonowski, Owen Powell, Nixie Poo, God of Fenboys, Angry Ares, Dan, PK Manta, Maxi Boy, Elizabeth Lagrosse, T Max V, Acker, Emerald Beam, and Yarrow as well. See you all for spooky time.